in South Texas. And this sector alone, Border Patrol right now is apprehending Chinese nationals at record numbers. Now, compared to last year, they're already seeing a 900% spike in Chinese national apprehensions. New in the news today, China reportedly reaches a secret billion dollar deal of a spy station targeting the U.S. And this is not even 100 miles off the U.S. coastline. A lot of people talking about China and whatever the heck they are up to. Could this go in line with their recent statement of them taming the world's most powerful explosive? They're sneaking up through the border with all of the migrants. Officials report that they're sneaking into Alaska, trying to spy up there. And while we all know about the reported spy balloons, but do you guys know how surrounded they are with our spy bases? I'll show you that too. Crazy information about China and their little moves trying to figure out our military secrets. Stuff you should know coming right up. If you guys are brand new here, welcome to our awesome community where we do prepping tips, emergency preparedness how-tos, and we go over news awareness, stuff that you should know. So if you find value in that, be sure to hit the notification bell so you guys can stay up to date. Let's jump into this one. So today we're gonna focus on what's in the news today, the newest stuff. Because if I told you everything I know about China and what they're doing all the way around the world, I'd be talking to you for an hour. And I'm also gonna tell you about this brand new explosive that they're bragging about, deadliest non-nuclear explosive in existence. And a lot of us know that they're slowly surrounding us and slowly working into our communities. But I'll give you an idea of how well we're surrounding that. Lots of news agencies reporting this, but here on Fox News, it reports China reportedly reaches secret billion dollar deal for Cuba spy station targeting the US sends a message. I always like how this is supposed to be a secret spy station, yet it's all over the news. The matter of the facts are though that they have reached a deal with Cuba, a billion dollar deal, which puts China less than a hundred miles off our US coastline. It reads, China reportedly secured a secret billion dollar deal with Cuba to build listening station targeting the US and the island nation less than 100 miles off American mainland. The big secret, right? The Wall Street Journal reported Thursday that China and Cuba have reached a secret agreement for China to establish electronic eavesdropping facility on the island, allowing China intelligence services to scoop up electronic communications throughout the southeastern U.S. where many military bases are located and monitor U.S. ship traffic. Well, that's almost as bad as letting them buy land next to our military bases, right? Which, yes, that has happened. The report citing officials familiar with the matter says China has agreed to pay cash-strapped Cuba several billion dollars to allow it to build the eavesdropping station and the two countries had reached an agreement in principle. The report says U.S. officials described the intelligence on the plans as convincing. So like I said, these guys are doing this all over the place. They're building infrastructure. They're moving in and taking over a lot of areas. If you guys happen to know some new ones, put them down in the comments below. U.S. officials described in the intelligence that the planned Cuba site apparently gathered in recent weeks as convincing the Wall Street Journal said. They said the base would enable China to conduct signal intelligence known as espionage, world as signal intelligence, which could include the monitoring of a range of communications, including emails, phone calls, and satellite transmissions. Well, there we go. They're probably already monitoring half of our phones because people have TikTok. But what I think is going on here is a whole different level. In this photo right here, you can see the Chinese minister with the Cuban minister, and this is on May 20th of 2023. China's reportedly to pay Cuba billions of dollars to set up a listening station targeting the US. And again, guys, this is less than 100 miles off our US coastline. And some of you still don't think anything's going on. There's definitely some stuff going on. And like I said, this is breaking news everywhere. Even Daily Mail puts China moves in next door. Beijing is building an electronic eavesdropping facility on Cuba just 100 miles from the Florida coast that will be able to scoop up military secrets. And one of our community members, Tina, also added this article right here from 
South China Morning Post. China has tamed the world's most powerful explosive, military scientists say. So here we have again, China flexing some of their advanced weapons. It says new synthesizing method can give five fold stability boost to CL-20, the deadliest non-nuclear explosive in existence. China research team says. So how people are saying this comes into play, the deadliest weapon, subpar the term nuclear. And a lot of people are saying that this type of a weapon keeps them subpar from nuclear weapons, which means keeps them out of that classification. You see where that's going? According to 2021 US study commissioned by the Pentagon, only China has CL-20 mass production capacity and has used it in some of its newest weapons. China's CL-20 research is reportedly closely linked to its nuclear weapons program. More powerful explosives reduce the size of nuclear weapons and can allow intercontinental ballistic missiles to travel further. So basically, you guys don't know any history on this stuff. This stuff was very unstable. It means you would be traveling in a tank going over some bumps. It pretty much turns the tank into a nuclear weapon as it went over a bump. So the basics of this report is they've found out how to harness it a little bit better from the movements, the vibration, and perfecting it at the same time. And like they said, China is reportedly the only place that can mass produce this stuff. Here in this photo, it shows the PLA-1 to keep the DF-27 under wraps after showcasing its DF-17 missiles at a major parade in Beijing in 2019. And the reason they're bragging about that is they say they can penetrate Hawaii, the Pentagon, through our defenses, and they're reporting that they have 27 of those hypersonic missiles. Not sure on why all the buzz on the secret spy station in Cuba now with the billions of dollars being paid to Cuba. Like I said, not a big secret. Question on most of our minds, is what is China up to? And I've read lots of comments. Some people are saying they're gonna try to take us out from within. Some people write in and say, We've already been sold out to them. They already own the US, but I told you, we've got a pretty good stance surrounding China. I have a pretty good photo that shows this. Here you can see the US military bases around China. As you can see, we definitely have plenty of US military bases around China. And this is where it comes into play when we have folks writing in saying, nothing to worry about, the US has got this. And then we get the comments that say, all this is is posturing back and forth games i know one thing is true all it takes is one person to accidentally pop off one person in the big bear country that's had enough a specific weapon fired off hitting a specific target could like i said in the last video put us back into the 1800s so the question is do you guys think that's where we're headed put it down in the comments below let me know what you think love reading through the comments that's the big buzz china paying cuba to put a huge spy station 100 miles off our US coastline. No shortage of interesting news these days. Please share this out so other people are aware. And if you guys haven't seen either one of these videos, must see videos. And like I always do, as I know more, I will keep you guys up to date. Keep prepping, keep learning, keep doing. We'll see you on the next one.